Hey guys, it's Joy, and I'm back with a little cooking thing for you guys. I'm going to tell you what I'm making today and tell you how I put it together and what I'm making for tomorrow. The first one is a what's called delicious chicken. I found this recipe online, and if I can remember where I found the link, I will link it. But all I did was I sprayed my pan, and I took this size pan, um, and I sprayed it, and I put in two chicken breasts. It's supposed to be four. I put in two because that's more than enough for Mom and I. That will give us leftovers for lunch tomorrow, and that will take care of the third meal for tomorrow. So what it is is I put the chicken breast in, and then in a bowl I mixed together in soup. So I took one can or one package of onion soup mix, one can of cream of chicken soup, and one um, eight ounce of sour cream. So I mixed them really well, and then I put that over top of my chicken. Uh, and then I am going to cover it with aluminum foil and I'm going to bake it for about an hour and then I'm going to uncover it and bake it for 30 minutes. So I'm going to get that going. So all I did was just mix the stuff and then pour it over top of the chicken. Okay, so now I'm going to open it, and it's cooking at 350 for one hour, and then it uncover it and cook it for another 30 minutes. Okay, in the meantime, I'm going to take this bowl and get the next thing going. So for the next one, I'm going to do the roast and get that started in the crock pot over there, um, because I may have a blown outlet over here. So I've got a roast, and I just grabbed whatever looked good in the front line of roast, um, this is a bottom round, so I'm just going to put that in my crock pot. So in this container now, I set that over here, I'm going to put in one cup of water, one cup of brown sugar, and the other onion pack soup mix, and one teaspoon of garlic powder, and then it's supposed to have salt and pepper. I never add the salt and pepper on this because this has so much sodium in it, and um, you know, it's like, I'm not big on pepper, so. Okay, I'm going to mix that together with a spoon. Okay, and then I'm just going to add in the, um, teaspoon of garlic powder, and then we'll be able to stir that up and put it in the pan. Crock pot, and turn the crock pot on low. Mix that all together. And then we're going to put that in the crock pot over the roast. So let's see if I can show you guys. That's okay. And it's going over here in my crock pot between my oven and my um, refrigerator. And I'm going to plug that in and turn that on to low so it cooks all night. And then in the morning I'll turn it over and let it cook the rest of the day. And then about 5 o'clock tomorrow we'll eat supper. There could be a couple sandwiches and maybe some mashed potatoes to go with that. And that'll be our supper tomorrow night. Now I'll rinse that and get that in my dishwasher. So that is how I am going to cook my supper for tomorrow night. Uh, I'll try to remember to show you how they both turn out. Well, how the, how the one turns out. Um, I've made them both several times, so they are very, very good. Well, the one several times. The one I've made a couple times. Um, but they are both very good. And... Uh, Hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope you all have a wonderful day filled with lots of love and laughter. I hope you're sad, stay in the future, only sad as you're happy, stay in the past, but if it's not, I hope you find the strength tender. Till next time, bye guys.